You're just as glamorous first thing in the morning as when you were when I last saw you. Bathed in a moonlight glow. Oh, give me a break. I bet that doesn't even work in Birmingham. <laughs> it doesn't work anywhere, unfortunately. <laughs> and don't remind me, I've got to go back. Oh, not for a bit yet, surely. Well, a man's got to do and all that, you know. Hmm. Actually, I, uh, I really enjoyed last night. It was uh, very civilised. Yeah, so did I. It's nice to get out, isn't it? Somewhere different. Mm. I must admit, I'd be uh, very tempted to stick around a little bit longer if, uh, you know, uh, circumstances allow. Oh, uh, that's 30p, please. Morning. Right. Morning, Sal. Oh, yeah. Thanks. Well, I'll uh, probably see you later on, then. Yeah? Yeah. Ta-da, Sal. See ya. Well? Well? Judy, can you empty some of these ashtrays, please? The place is a right mess. I'm rushed off my feet. Yes, we'll find another gear, will you? There's loads of glasses need collecting and all. Oh, I'll find another pair of hands while I'm at it then, shall I? I'm sorry. I shouldn't be complaining. It's easy. Well, you girls carry on. I'll give you a hand. Uh, dig us a brushing bucket out for them ashtrays. I'll do them later when I clear a few glasses. No, it's all right. Cheers. Please yourself, love. I'm only trying to save your legs, that's all. It's no big deal. That'll be a big help, Terry. Thank you. No problem. Don't mention it. Too sure of himself, yes, me. Yes, well, that seems to be the general opinion, but you know, speak as you find. He's always been very upfront with me. And anyway, I'm not going to turn down help when we're this busy. Oh, I don't know. There's something dodgy going on there. And knowing him, there'll be a price to pay later on. How come Grandad's little helper gets so much time off? That's what I'd like to know. She's already had her remedies once. Well, maybe it is genuinely a business trip and he needs someone from work to go along and give him an hand. I suppose it only makes sense that he takes a longer. Hayley. Do you always see the good side of everybody? It's not natural. Still, I'd rather walk through all done on a wet night with a nail in my shoe. He's dead, our kid. As far as I know, yeah. Yeah, you can take this one and all. Cheers. How are you? Hello. How are you? Oh, you've met then. Sorry? How do you mean? Oh, right. Um, Danny, this is Terry. Terry? Oh, Terry. I'm sorry I'd shake on the, uh, I didn't know you worked in here. No, neither did I. Just doing them a favour while they're busy. Oh. Charles told me how your friends from way back. Thanks for feeding them, by the way. Oh, charming. Uh, I told Danny we were going out. Right. Can I get you a pint? No, uh, thanks. Uh, I'd best get on with these. Right. Hey, you can get me one, though. <laughs> so, are you taking me out tonight or what? You're supposed to be playing five aside. The lads are short. You're not bothered, are you? No. Come your boyfriend, has he? No, he's having some work done on his van. Well, it didn't take you long to get your feet under the table, did it? He seems like a decent bloke. You what? I mean, another bloke taking his girlfriend out for a meal. I don't know if I'd be so laid back about it. You didn't take me out. Anyway, if he's laid back, it's because he's got now to worry about now, has he? Fair enough. Right then. I'm just saying, that's all. Yeah. OK. Well, I'm off. I've got work to do. Hiya. We're back. Hello, right. oh, no, Wanderers. We, we, we've, not, we've not come for a drink. Well, 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 I've not, anyway. Oh, come on, what can I get you? You're looking well, mate. Um, yeah, come on, you sit down. Let other foot wait on you for a change. Yeah. Don't worry, Kev, I'll get these. Oh, that's very simple of you. Um, I'll, I'll have an orange juice with ice, please. But since you're going mad, I'll have a double. <laughs> yeah, and as soon as I'm drinking for two, I'll have a large white wine. Oh, right. What's he playing at? What's he doing behind the bar? Don't start that, all right? Don't start! Steady up. Do you think you can come in here and start taking over the flaming pot? Oh, Jack, for goodness sake, he collected a few glasses that Yes, for now! You've got some face on you. I know what it is. I know what it is with you. You're trying to see me off, aren't you? You're getting yourself all worked up. Come in anywhere near me and I'll put your face hey, in. Hey, steady on, Jack. Jack! I'm, I'm sorry about this. But Jack, you're causing a scene. I mean, let's make out we get on, at least in public. I am not stopping here with him. Stop getting on at him, will you? You'll, you get yourself all round up and you'll end up back in hospital again. I don't give a damn. Terry, why don't you nip through to the back for a few minutes? Look, I'm only Please. trying to... What are you doing? And what's it look like? I might as well be back in Birmingham and stay up here and put up with this. Look, put your case back to your love. Let me have a word with your dad. Look, give him a chance, eh? Like he's giving me. Well, you're gonna have to patch it up between you, aren't you? 
He don't think so. Look, I know he's stubborn, but he's had a lot on his mind lately, and here's your dad. Mum, I came back up here because I thought you might need me around. I did it for you, not for him. I wish I'd not bothered. Look, he'll come round. And, and listen, you haven't seen out of your Brad yet, have you? Look, stop a bit longer, please, Terry. Well, what's the point? I mean, I'm not welcome round here. My business is going down the pan. I'm stuck with this car I've still got to get rid of. I can't afford to stay. I'm on me uppers as it is. Well, at least think about it, Terry. I'd need a bit of cash if I was going to stick around, so I might as well go now. What are you saying? Well, if I thought that you could help me out, ma'am, well, you know, I could get shut of that Birmingham job and come back up here like you say. I'd need a fair bit of cash, though, I mean, to get things moving. Uh, I know I've let you down in the past, but this is dead straight, this is. How much? Well, a grand, that's all. And I'd pay you back before you'd even know it was gone. And it's not as if you haven't got it, is it? Ma'am? And I believed you. I thought you were different this time. But you haven't changed, have you? You only came back for money. You must think I'm stupid. Won't be a minute. All right. You uh, not seen Danny tonight? No, he's got some five side things. Well, why don't we do something then? It can't be better than stopping in here with Rita all night. No, oh, I'm happy, thanks. I'm just saying, but uh, I wouldn't have left you by yourself for a game of football. That's all. Well, come on, let's go downtown and get something to eat. I'm starving. No, I'm not going anywhere, Terry. And I don't want folk telling me where I should be going and who I should be going out with. When have I ever done that? Well, I'm not talking about you. Look, let's just keep it as old pals, eh? And I'm not getting earache of all this sundry. So who's been having a go now, then? Does it matter? Depends on what's being said. Th I'm better off staying out of your rod. <sighs> More tittle-tattle from folk without better to do. They make me sick. This is coming from your own family, if you must know. Me dad? I've told you what he's like. I don't know why you bother taking any notice of him. Your mum, actually. <laughs> <laughs> 